three ghosts trapped on video. Hello folks all over the world, here we are again to attend the 16th episode of this series that you are also enjoying in the various sections dedicated to the theme within some social networks. I apologize for last week but an ominous event led us to dedicate our thoughts, this episode is dedicated to this person. If you like the contents and you are not subscribed to this channel, press the subscribe button and the bell that will allow you to stay updated on new channel events. Let's start immediately with the third position. Shadow figures inside the house. Recently, a young policeman from Mansfield, USA, posted several videos on his TikTok channel called Gage Mansfield, based on philosophical discourses of the importance of life following the dangers, tragedies and deaths that his profession entails. But around mid-July 2021, he begins to hear suspicious noises in his home so he decides to install some internal security cameras. We will analyze two videos that he posted not only on his TikTok channel but also on his YouTube channel, Gage Mansfield, respectively published on June 27, 2021 and September 12, 2021. Let's see them together. The camera records a sinister shadow walking along the corridor wall in the middle of the night. Attracted by strange noise, the man enters the room and we can see how his figure is identified by the camera through the focus rectangle but also how his shadow projected on the wall is clearly darker than the strange shadow seen previously, as we have already seen in previous videos about these paranormal entities. In this video, shot by the security camera at 12 am, together with the poltergeist with the object moving by itself and falls from the desk, you can see behind the door a dark shadow that moves very quickly. At the end of the video, you can see against the light on the surface of the door, this shadow with humanoid features from which you can see how the head is really very large compared to the shoulder. It is difficult to understand if it is an alien presence as we have already seen in other testimonies, a ghost or an elaborate hoax. And what do you think? Have you got an idea? Let me know in the comments. Immortalized by media. In second position this week we have a really interesting video. Filmed live by WNYT TV, known to air as News Channel 13, it is a local New York news channel that covers news from Albany and the surrounding area. On October 22, 2021 the reporter Sam Hesseler was filming live on the morning news from the Green Ridge Cemetery in Saratoga County, when the camera captures something truly unusual. And as you can see behind me here, we have a few gravestones, but what you can't see because it's dark out, and as you can see behind me here, we have... On the left of the screen, between the gravestones in the cemetery, a translucent figure passes from right to left very quickly. The genuineness of the video is guaranteed by the shooting and live broadcasting in the early hours of the morning. The incredible thing is that you can see the torso of the figure but not the legs, even if it is not clear whether it is a male or female entity. It is really impressive the resemblance to the classic translucent figure that we see photographed in old ancient photos that show paranormal entities. Are we in front of a real video exhibit or is it a play of lights given by the cameras? 
the dark entity of the chapel. In the first place, we will talk about a video that for its genuineness stands out from the huge mass of jokes or obviously fake videos. This is Dave, a paranormal investigator who visits abandoned places in England with techniques and equipment that make the videos particularly serious and interesting. On October 31, 2021, Dave posted a video on his YouTube channel Paranormal Explorers during a patrol of the Chapel of St. Mary, a quiet and hidden place of sanctity, right in the middle of a busy suburb of Newcastle upon Tyne. Here the legend has it that the Virgin Mary appeared during the Norman invasion and that the well had healing properties following the massacre and atrocious killings committed during the invasion. People who have ventured into the night speak of paranormal phenomena, dark figures, and voices around the chapel grove. Let's see together. 12th century, there was an apparition of the Virgin Mary holding the baby Jesus. Minutes after arriving at the chapel through the forest, Dave begins a truly incredible spirit box radio session, with consistent and immediate responses. My name is David. Who tell us your name? Hi. You ready? You ready? Can you tell us what this place is? Did anybody die here? The court. Love working hard. Oh, guys, this place gives me the creeps. You know, when I'm in the trees and stuff like that, it always freaks us out. Dave continues his patrol of the place in the middle of the night, completely alone. During the filming, he also stops to take some photos of the place. I've been, I've been told about lots of rituals and stuff that took place here. And at the well, that's like a shrine. Right next to the river. Burnt down. Part of it burnt down at the back. Got cameras all over it. <laughs> Alarms and everything. Were you able to see it? When Dave reaches the entrance to the chapel, a dark shadow can clearly be discerned from the first floor window walking inside the abandoned corridors of the building. The shadow appears to have something swinging behind it, perhaps a cloak or shawl. Probably an antique night dress. Is it the energies that have wandered these lands for centuries that cause these inexplicable phenomena? What do you think? See you on Saturday with a new Top 3 Ghosts event. As always, thank you for your support, for watching, and I wish you good night.